Hey y'all, Sparkling Too Sweet coming at you. Yep, this is what I'm doing on my New Year's. Um, y'all have to forgive me. I'm on medication, y'all. But um, it's like 25 minutes to 12. And I just want to say Happy New Year's. I'm sorry I'm not all bubbly and cheerful, but my back, my back been really giving me the blues, y'all, and um, I gotta get myself together before I go back to work. Yep, I tell you the truth, my back been hurting me for about three weeks now, that old sciatic nerve, so y'all. Yep, that's why I've been missing in action. That's why I haven't been doing no videos. Because of this back of mine. Yep, so I got the um the TV on the Fox channel. I don't know what channel that is. I think it's channel 15 here in Arizona. Got my remote. Channel 10. I'm watching the, uh, uh oh, don't know what my tab. I'm watching the, uh, New Year's party over in New York. Um, for New Year's, y'all, I stay in the comfort of my own home. Yep, I cook me some black eyed peas. Yep, I'm letting those cool off on the stove. And then, um, I'm going to prepare some, uh, Spare ribs in the oven. They thick too and hearty. Um, some spare ribs, um, greens, macaroni and cheese, and some dressing. I don't know how the dressing gonna come out because uh, my knee screwed it up for Thanksgiving, and um, I tried to redo it. So we froze it. Well, I, well my nephew froze it and. Uh, Put it out. I don't really want none because that's not on my uh, but um, yeah, she made it salty and then I put more cornbread in it and then I think I made it salty again because I put that um, cream of mushroom soup in there. And you know, I never knew I've been using that for years and I never knew it was salty like that. Yep, but my daughter-in-law told me, but by the time I had already mixed it in, because I had bought one that didn't have no salt, that must have been a low sodium camp. But anyway, you guys have a happy new year. May God bless you. May God watch over you. May he keep you from all hurt, harm, and danger, seen and unseen, and that he will bless us. To make it through another year, y'all. Another year. That we make it through these next 12 months. Okay, unharmed. Yes, unharmed. No accidents. No freak accidents. Because y'all, they popping off out there. They is really getting it. And may God bless you to stay in good health, most of all. If I didn't say that. Um... Boy, they performing out there anyway. They don't care if it is raining. Yeah, your Fox News is at 21 minutes. Uh, I just thank God that I'm here. I had a birthday. I had a birthday. And I am now 59 years old, y'all. And what did I get for my birthday? Sparkling too sweet. Bought her a car on birthday. Yep. So I'm going to enjoy that and enjoy paying for it. Yep. You know them car notes, and they gotta have insurance. Um. But you know what? It was it it was something. It was something that clicked in me, in my mind, in my heart, y'all. 
and um, I can't really explain to you what it is or what it was, but it brought me to the point where I'm not going to worry about stuff anymore. You know, I'm not going to worry about basically my future, my retirement. I'm sorry, y'all. They got this lady singing without any music. Let me turn it up. She's singing. Uh, she's trying to sing uh, Whitney Houston song. Oh, well, anyway, sorry, it was a distraction. But, yeah, um, I'm going to enjoy uh, my car because I got it now. I ain't got no choice. But, yeah, I, I just come to the conclusion that we have to take one day at a time, y'all. One day at a time. Don't worry about what tomorrow's going to bring. You know, I know we work and we try to plan for, for vacations. We try to plan to go see our parents, our loved ones, and stuff like that. But y'all, one day at a time, okay? Because we know tomorrow, next month, it's not promised. But we praying that God will take us through the entire year of 2019, okay, in spite of the gov change in governments, in spite of the change in times, we praying for that, let me turn this to you there, yep, so y'all, above all, be safe, drink responsibly, don't be texting and driving, above all, because I see that a lot, okay? Don't be texting and driving. Stay safe. Keep your family safe, okay? And if you have any firearms around the house, put them up where your kids can't get to them, okay? Don't be leaving firearms laying around on tables and stuff. And if you do drugs, if you drink, put that stuff up. Don't do it around the kids. Because kids do what they see their parents do. I work with kids, okay? And honey, let me tell you something. Them kids be telling me what's going on in their house. And y'all, put your stuff up. If you got to have you a cocktail, make sure your kids are asleep. Doors closed, okay? So, with all that being said, I'm going to get off of here. I'd have been on here for about eight minutes. I love you guys. Forgive me. You know, hey, I got something dealing with this sciatic nerve. And right now, I did take some medication. And I'm feeling a little loopy. But... I do feel a whole lot better than I would because it was really bothering me, y'all. I mean, it got to the point where it was hard for me to sit down and it was hard for me to stand up. Even when I was cooking my black eyed peas, girl. Yep. Um, it was bothering me. So, hopefully this year, I'm looking for a camera. Hopefully this year I'll be able to put out some content. I really want to uh, start me a whole new YouTube channel. Um, now that I have a better car, 
And I do have a mount, but y'all, it's my phone. It's my phone. I don't have no iPhone. I bought a GoPro, but I don't know how good that's going to be because it was one of them wish things. So, yep. So, I took my nails off to give my feet, my hand a rest because you know I don't like my nails looking like this. This is ratchet to me. And tell you the truth, y'all, my hands feel so freaking light for some reason without them nails. I'm like, I feel so naked. So naked. And I don't, my hands just, I don't know, just weird. Like, they short. <laughs> like, my fingers are too short. Yep. So, I'm tripping. I'm tripping, y'all. Yep. Tripping off this medication. And in bed, that's my mom up there. She is deceased. Pan around. Let me show you. That's my sister. Can barely see her. She's deceased. Y'all, I got my bed so freaking high. I have to use a step ladder to get in this bed. Yep. It is one of those um, memory foam mattress. I mean, the Joker is thick. It is really thick. It got the box frame and the mattress. And plus, what I did was uh, my old mattress. This is my my sister's bed. My sister bed. I inherited when she passed away. She just bought it just bought it. I mean, I don't think she had it a year. Um, so that means it wasn't even paid for neither, but the uh, the furniture store that she bought it from, she bought it from Cons. Cons Furniture Store. When I called them and told them that she had passed away and uh, I wanted to know how much did she owe on her account. And uh, the guy told me, he said, don't even worry about it. We forgive her. You know, she's gone. So he uh, sent me his condolences. And I said, well, I can bring the mattress, everything. But he said, man, we don't want that mattress. So he said, you take it, you enjoy it, and we're we going to forgive her alone. And I was like, thank you. But I took my uh, old box spring and left it on the frame, and then I put the new box bring in the mattress up so that made it really high oh, yes yeah, really high that, you know I'm looking at myself in here and my eyes is going all kind of ways I'm like Gee, this one is really dry really dry y'all pray for me climbing up this step ladder trying to get in this bed and um dealing with my back Dry eyes. You guys pray for me. Okay. So, I know it's kind of boring. I know my channel be kind of boring. But at the same time, y'all hold on. I'm bringing something. I'm putting some stuff together. Okay. Have a happy New Year's, y'all. All right, I'll talk to you soon.